KU TV mizizi ya habari. Karibu tena. Sote tunajua rafiki au jamaa ambaye amewahi kuwa mwathiriwa wa wizi jambo ambalo ugadhabisha mno lakini je unaweza kuamini kwamba kuna teknolojia mpya ambayo kwa asilimia fulani huweza kutumika kuzuia wizi na hata kusaidia katika uchunguzi wa kunasa vilivyopotea teknolojia hii inajulikana kwa jina microdot basi kaange tukujuze zaidi Je, unatambua kwamba kitu chenye udogo mithili ya chembe ya chumvi uweza kutumika kusaidia katika uchunguzi wa vifaa vilivyopotea katika wizi kama vile vifaa vya kielektroniki au hata magari? Basi kupitia teknolojia ya microdot ambayo imewasili nchini, uwizi wa vifaa vya thamani kwetu vimepungua kwa asilimia 30. Microdot ni kifaa kidogo zaidi mno chenye nambari maalum ambayo iko katika idadi ya maelfu na unyunyizwa katika sehemu mbalimbali kwenye kifaa ambacho ni cha thamani na ambacho kiko katika hatari ya kuibiwa. Nambari hiyo maalum sajiliwa katika hifadhi ya habari katika kampuni husika. Malilok Kenya ni kampuni ambayo inajihusisha na uzuiaji wa wizi wa magari na iliandikisha historia kwa kuwa kampuni ya kwanza nchini kuanzisha utumizi wa teknolojia ya Microdot. Tunakutana naye Timothy Keitany ambaye ni mwandisi na meneja mkurugenzi katika kampuni ya afisi ya Malilok iliyo katika barabara ya Ngong na anatueleza kuhusu manufaa na utumizi wa Microdot. Microdots are each made out of nickel metal which boils at 1200 degrees centigrade therefore enabling us to install the microdots in very hot areas uh, the, com the the liquid bonding the microdot on the surface of the asset is uh, uses a uv detergent that enables law enforcement officers and anyone trying to do an inspection to be able to view it easily by putting uv light over it Teknolojia hii hautumi mfumo wowote wa kielektroniki hivyo basi haiwezi kudukuliwa mtandaoni kama vifaa vya kawaida vinavyotumika kuzuia uwizi wa magari People are using all forms or all manners of uh, securing their vehicles um, using GPS trackers steering lock box uh, steering locks and many other forms of just trying to protect your vehicles and they are working they are working but still vehicles are being stolen Biashara ya kuuza vipuri vya magari imenoga mno jambo ambalo limefanya uwezi kuwa na uraibu wa kuiba magari na kutenganisha vipande kisha kuviuza. Inakadiriwa kwamba zaidi ya magari mene upotea kwenye barabara zetu kila siku huku takwimu zikionyesha kuwa asilimia mbili pekee ndio uweza kupatikana. Hii ni kwa sababu magari hukatwa kisha kuunganishwa ili kuyapa sura mpya. For any solution that you're trying to get into the market I think the main thing first of all is to understand what is the value proposition to the people who are actually taking this particular solution on board. And I think the main the one clear thing is that we are giving you a chance for a very small fee. We are giving you a chance for recovery. Teknolojia hii ilivumbuliwa nchini Afrika Kusini ambapo uwizi wa magari ulikuwa donda sugu mwaka 2012 bunge la kitaifa nchini humo lilipitisha sheria ambayo ililazimisha kampuni ya uzaji magari na zile za kutengeza vipuri vya magari kukumbatia teknolojia hii ili kupunguza uwizi wa magari uh, we are more focused on actually providing a solution first of all in that The, the, the people who are going to embrace this particular technology first of all and all the stakeholders that are going to uh, adopt this particular technology what that will do in the essence in the long run is going to eradicate the market for stolen goods Washikadau katika teknolojia hii wanawasi wa bunge humu nchini kupendekeza mswada utakaofanya utumizi wa microdot kuwa sheria katika sekta ya magari humu nchini Already the government is seeing microdot as a solution first of all for asset tagging to identify cars that are being manufactured locally and cars that are being imported so that's already an avenue for us because them they're just exploiting one uh, angle for this particular solution which is uh, mainly identification ili kuona nambari ya usajili kwenye microdot tutahitajika kutumia hadubini au katika lugha ya Kiingereza microscope ambayo ina uwezo wa kuona zaidi ya mara moja kuliko jicho la binadamu Luka kigeni mteja wa Malilo kambali leta gari lake kuingizwa kwenye teknolojia hii baada kuisikia kuhusu ujio wake nchini ingawa gari lake linaonekana kuwa la kisasa na lenye vifaa na mitambo mbalimbali mbali ya kuzuia uwizi.
Uh, what is different about this particular technology and innovation is the fact that most of the time if you have been able to keep track of what how vehicles appear and they are never traced again it's because some of them are stolen in a short while they are taken into some carriages and they are dismembered and they become they are sold in formal parts Namna tulivyo taja wali microdot CO2 ya kulinda magari kwa wizi bali pia vifaa vya kielektroniki ambavyo hutumika nyumbani na afisini ambavyo viko katika hatari ya kuibwa Kurunzi maalum ya UV utumika kutambua ikiwa kifaa kina chembe chembe za microdot na ikiwa chembe chembe zizo ziko hadubini hutumika kungamua nambari ya usajili iliyopo na ikiwa kifaa hicho kilipatikana kwa njia ya wizi basi mwenyewe ufahamishwa na ikiwa wizi huo ulikuwa wa kimabavu basi mwasiriwa anaweza kuhusisha polisi Tulipo kuwa katika shule ya chekechea wa vile wetu walikuwa kiaka lama katika vifaa vyetu vya shule kama vile viombo, vitabu na hata sare ili kusaidia kuvifata punde tu vinavyopotea. Lakini kile ambacho tukuweza kungamua ni kwamba wazo hili lingeweza kuzalisha teknolojia kama vile microdot ambayo tumeweza kuona inaweza kutumika ili kuzuia uwizi wa magari na hata kuvipata punde tu vinavyopotea. Samson Jura, KUTV. Thank <laughs> you.